Ramble. Thank you to Chime for sponsoring today's episode. You, you, you doing the directions? I kind of sometimes it's comforting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. Although yesterday, GM Google Maps fucked me down. What, what did happened? they do to you? It was one of those things where it's like, okay, in point one miles, take an exit uh, on the, this road, and I'm like, no, that's nothing. You got it. You got to warn me. A better heads up because now I'm on a bridge and I can't do it. And you know how much time it added to my ETA? Much. Hmm. Fifteen minutes. Oh, oh. that I is felt sad. That is really tough. And Luckily, we're gonna we're gonna wash your woes with mm. some cake because mm. obviously we're here with Johnny Cake Pops. Johnny yeah. Cake Pops. <laughs> Let's go, Johnny. Johnny, welcome to the show. Thank you so much. It's great to be here. Now <laughs> we ha- we don't often have guests on the triplog right. because yeah. we're sort of a roving carousel at right. this point. Yeah, we're sort of a, a band of minstrels that don't specialize in music on this show. Mm. We mm. otherwise, otherwise, though, we're a band. We're singing. Mm. We're beatboxing. I don't really know if you've good. heard the episode of Rainy Learns to Harmonize. It's, <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's a top-notch app. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I start, you know, not knowing necessarily about tunes, but by the end, I'm like, okay, I'm Hannah Montana. About tunes, You're, you are Hannah Montana. What if <laughs> yeah. you were a secret like? I've thought about song. that frequently. Who I would think it that, be? Rainy Montana, Rainy to Idaho, Rainy Ooh. Idaho could yeah. be strong. Rainy Idaho. But I think maybe I would have to change my first name, too. How do they not know she's a pop star? She's just wearing a different wig. Well, but the wig is so glam <laughs> that basically... Don't poke holes in Tana Montana. Okay, sorry. Okay? Because that's actually... <laughs> No, you know what I'll say, Johnny. What? Johnny, did you watch Hannah Montana when it was out? Well, I was grown, so... Well, sorry, not... Sorry. What do you mean grown? I was grown, wasn't I? You probably, maybe. How old I was you? grown. 32. I'm 30. You watched it? Like, for, like, like you watched it like... <laughs> sorry. But wait, did you watch it wow. like for real? No, I'm sorry, but did you watch it for real or for fake? I downloaded episodes <laughs> on my iPod video and I watched it under the covers, actually. I can't believe I'm four years older than you, Johnny. You feel like such more of a man than me. Oh, have you seen anything I've done? <laughs> anything I've said? I know, any but, hand motion but look that at I you. Use? You've, got, you've got this... I think it's the beard. I mean, anybody with a beard, it's like you you have seen things. I had a beard when I was like 14. Exactly. I was not a man. So you were a man (laughs) way earlier than I was. Yeah, you look at Johnny and you're like, this is a guy that has Geico or something. Yeah. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What? I don't know. You've got like insurance. (laughs) Do you think I look rich? No. Nobody's saying that. Is Geico the rich insurance? (laughs) I don't know. No, I guess you save on Geico. (laughs) You save with Geico. And progressive. They all all claim you save money. They all. Yeah, which one? That one's called Pimp Nail Bar, by By the way. way, We have not been to Pimp Nail Bar, but we got to go. You really have to go to pimp. Do you want nails like a pimp? Come on down. Is this like a thing you've already discussed on the tripod? Uh, so this is sort of our home field right yeah, there. We go we're going to, into. There's sort of a triangle of shops that okay, we go to it. really, really often. <laughs> this woman staring at us. Do you she get did. that a lot? She's reaching into her back pocket to get her phone as well. Right. Very and I felt that it was sexual. It was sexual in nature. It was sexual getting oh, her phone? I, see what's I don't know, but she reached in. Anyway, Johnny, so we're going to get cake pops and review Woo! them because yeah. obviously they're cake King. Yes. We're here at an off hour and it is not busy and I'm loving it. Normally, I'm loving it. we didn't look at the menu, Keith. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do? We're going to ask what kind of cakes what do you have? Cake, we'll yeah. take one of each. Well, Keith has a life hack that's going to get us a full piece of, a full thing of cake. This, that's McDonald's. Oh, yeah. Keith. I've heard about this, Keith. Have you seen it? I don't TikTok? know if it's real, but I've seen someone fake. do it and I feel like it's got to be fake, but. It's let's test it out ourselves. Yes. And yeah. that's that you can just ask for a full birthday cake at McDonald's and, it's and, got and they might McDonald's have it. On yeah, it. we're gonna want to be okay, so we're at the oh, at the oh, order here. Oh, wow, look at all Hi, the thank you for taking Starbucks. We're gonna get Starbucks pizza. Hi, we're um doing a little bit of a cake hunt today <sighs> and we wanted to try all of the cake pops that you have and any other cake, cake treats. Cake. <laughs> we have a coffee cake, did you wanna do mm. that? Mm. Oh, wow. You pulled them all up. We need an owl cake. Uh, I don't think we want the coffee cake, although it is my preferred cake, but maybe the lemon loaf, because that's kind of a cake. And what flavor is the owl cake? We got to get the owl flavor. What flavor is owl? The owl is the same as the birthday. It's a vanilla flavor. Mm. Say it's birthday. Um, Okay. And then do you guys want anything else? Um, Johnny, do you want something to drink? Uh, you know, I have a coffee I brought with me. Okay. I think I'm okay. At this point, awesome. I've had a lot. I'm feeling pretty turned. I think I think that's all we need, and I love <laughs> the subtotal of 1555. I think it's a great number. Are you great. not allowed? Yeah, to, it's okay. Are you not allowed? 
Thank oh, you. It's sort of a clear. You know when you're like babysitting and it's like, can I take their food yes, that I'm working you for them? It, oh my God. The answer is yes. You can yeah, obviously take their food. <laughs> I don't know if you can go. take it home. Yeah, you can. You yes. take, <laughs> I think it's, I think it's, a, I think it's a buffet. Can I to go, go to the fridge and take your frozen chicken tenders and bring it to my house? Wait, can I just tell you guys my theory about cake pops? Yeah, what's yeah. that? Well, that's not really a theory, but I do think about it a lot. Okay. They're, they're just cake chicken nuggets. Because oh. it's all the bits and bobs that they don't put in the in the oh. good stuff. Oh. They they grind it all together like yeah. chicken nugget chicken nugget meat. Like a fudge sickle. Yep. They throw some frosting in it. Wow. You're right. it, honestly. And they, they, make they put a lot of frosting in it. It's yeah, it's so dense and gross it, to me. I do I do have a yeah. question though. It's not my but preferred method. For the, for the cake pop. Now, John. <laughs> can I John. call you John? <laughs> sure. <laughs> John, can, is it just John? Can we Jake? just can we just start giving each other different names? But like, <laughs> like Milo, listen, Milo. Well, now here's the thing: is it John? Well, now obviously, normally you're Johnny Cakes, yeah. but if you say John, then it's sort of like John Cack, John, John Cake. Well, you know, John I Cake. went by John for forever, and then mm. Joe Manganiello was hot and famous and married to Sofia mm. Vergara, and I was like, people are getting us confused <laughs> <laughs> all the time. <laughs> They were confusing so all the it's time because so, everything else was so similar. Right, it got exhausting. So I was like, I gotta change my name now. Johnny yep. Cakes. You yep. know that there is that pancakes are sometimes called Johnny Cakes. I've heard. So have you ever explored any pancake stuff? Making old <laughs> style pancakes. Yeah, I just made a pancake cake actually. Really? You did. Uh -huh. It looked like a stack of pancakes, but it was all icing. Hi, Good, we're doing well. You? Thank you. We're back. Which okay. cake pop is your favorite? I like the chocolate. Chocolate. The chocolate? Oh, did we get okay, that? Cool. Chocolate. Keith, I think you're supposed to grab your card. Are you ready? Do you like cake pops as a like unit, like just in general? Do I like cake pops? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I prefer cake. Like I prefer yeah. cake. Thanks. I mean, we, I think we all do. I call them <laughs> cake chicken nuggets. Yeah, they're kind of like chicken nuggets, right? They're like broken down and yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Thank <laughs> you. Yeah. Now we've had a cake pop, but I'm curious to hear Johnny Cake Pop yeah. talk about his experience with. Cake pops. Mm. Well, we're honoring your surname in this episode because it's the cake episode. We're reviewing all sorts of cakes. <laughs> yeah. My surname, Mr. Cakes. Um, mm -hmm. With the expert himself. Yeah, You're I sort of the cake diplomat. Mm. You know, like the mm. embassy. You're sort of the cake boss, if mm. I may. The cake cake boss. I am I am the cake boss. Liaison. <laughs> Famously, that is what I am. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Can I get the receipt, too? Hi, how's it going? We're back. Doing so well. We're back. We're always here. Appreciate it. Do we know her? <laughs> thank you. I, oh, thank you so much. I love these people. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, they're sort of they're like so our friendly. old friends at this point. They, they threw in a nice lemon loaf as well. I asked for it. Oh, got it. Is this something you wanted for, for, to well, have it, for home? Because it's cake. <laughs> for oh, home. It is technically it, it's cake. a cake. <laughs> Although you said no to coffee cake. Wait yeah, a minute. This one's Wait a more minute. cake than that. You think lemon loaf is more cake than coffee? <laughs> this yes. is bread. Uh-uh. <laughs> it's not bread. My, it's my, it's Milo. 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 Sorry. Oh, I bet Chuck E. Cheese has cake. No, they don't. No. They don't. Oh, actually, they probably they would. Probably birthday they cake. probably do. We've already been. <laughs> okay. Been there, done that. Sorry, Johnny. We no, go to... Uh, name a restaurant in this area. We've probably gone to it. <laughs> okay. And, by, uh, and I just named Chuck E. Cheese because that's the only one Wing we Stop. To. We have not been to... We have been to IHOP. Now, the other question yeah. I had that I've been worrying about, honestly, this whole time... Okay. Is that um, we've got cake pops? Mm. Those feel like a one and done bite situation to me. How are we going to share? How are we going to share? Wait, did I think we get like one of We each? don't get to. No, we all. I think we have to each pick one, and we just have uh, to really do our due right. diligence talking about how nice we think they are. Yeah. yeah, a lot of them are the same flavor. Normally, there's only actually a chocolate and a birthday cake flavor. It's more textural, I think. It, and I hate the texture and the flavor typically. <laughs> pre uh, pre COVID, I'm we could suck it, down the same cake pops. But yeah, we could just kind of lick, do a little lick. Pass. Yeah, let's Lick, go to the pass. Chuck E. Cheese parking lot. Just a couple normal <laughs> adults eating Chuck E. Cheese parking lot co cake pops. I, mean, I think we could go in and just see if they sell cake. I hear you can't go into Chuck E. Cheese without a child. That's, That's not, not true. true. We okay. did it. We've okay. done it. Johnny? I'm giving that? you the chocolate cake oh, pop. Okay, great. And I opted to give myself the owl, and I want you to all know that I did like know I was going to do that. The okay. owl is the most viral <laughs> one right now, and it comes after the viral bee that, that didn't uh, look like a bee. That was what everybody was yeah, talking was about. Sad. What did I get? You got the cookies and cream. Oh, lucky. lucky! That is actually lucky. This one I remember being better from the Starbucks eat the menu. No, I feel like we got we got to go in motion. So Keith, you're going to take a bite, and then you're going to talk about how you feel. <laughs> and are we putting the whole ball in our mouth well, at once? Yeah, it, and we're going to put. I think we're going to go full balls in our mouth. <laughs> okay. And we're going to swallow. We're going to gulp the whole thing. Yeah. yeah. Make sure to swallow, swallow it whole. Spit. Don't swallow choke. Spitters oh, that's a bite. Lo losers choke. Joker's toke. Okay, <laughs> cool. Let's try the entire <laughs> cookies and cream cake pop. Keith. 
Wow. Oh, that's child's no, play. No, he's got to spit that's it out. Child's play for kids. You're a spitter? No, no, no. He's not okay. a spitter. <laughs> Jesus, Randy. Sorry. It was, it was harder to <laughs> take. I thought that my easy. lips would be. I thought my lips would be able to pull it off. It no, it's I needed my need teeth. No. How and how do you feel about it? It seemed like it smelled a little bit like espresso. Mm. It doesn't taste like that. It's a bit much bigger in your mouth than you think it's going to be. Really? Yours might not be because yours is flat. This is owl. Mine was <laughs> it's filling up my whole mouth. <laughs> Because I got the owl one. Which, by the way, it's a purple owl. Show me an owl <laughs> that looks like this. I don't know. Maybe a spooky Halloween one in Michael's. Mm. That's a really good point. Mm. <laughs> he shut you up real quick. Why he's the boss. He shut me up with this one thing. Is our <laughs> clickbait clip headline. Uh, it's, I'm still eating it. Yeah, it looks like it's kind of stuck in your gums. Mm -hmm. It's good tasting, but I don't think I recommend putting the whole thing in your mouth at once. Do you think mm. it would be good with a hot chocolate? It would be good with a hot coffee. It's Ooh. so sweet. Oh. Also, yeah. like bitter and hot to help me get through it. Now, I think I want Johnny Cake Pops to have his cake pops. Johnny. Really? Taste. Okay. All right, just whole thing. A lot of frosting. A lot of frosting, huh? Oh, my God. A pro. A pro. Look what I saw was a lot. <laughs> now, what was that? <laughs> big, big ball. Big ball. Big, big ball. ball. But not too big. Smushed. But not, not too big. big. <laughs> Mm. All right, should I do it? Are you are you reviewing? You swallowing? I'm swallowing. Okay. <laughs> Rainy has the birthday cake pop. <laughs> I told you oh, you can't do this to the lips. She's going, she went for it, and it's honestly the same look from everyone. It's confidence, and Johnny was the only one who was successfully able to pull it off. Yeah. Yeah. What's that? Well, about? did you start with your teeth? Did you use your teeth? See, I thought I was going to be able to use just my lips. And people Wrong. say no teeth. <laughs> and people say no teeth. Because then you not use teeth. People you say You have yeah. to use teeth just a little. And this is, I think, of, of tried and true, <laughs> you should use your teeth. Well, now, what are you doing? What are you looking for? Keith, are you looking for the lemon loaf? I'm just getting <laughs> the lemon loaf <laughs> ready. Sorry, Keith, was, Keith was literally so hungry. He was like <laughs> looking around, peeking around for the lemon loaf. <laughs> like, where'd that lemon loaf end up? Where'd that lemon loaf end it's up? It's cake. So you, so you, well, first of all, Johnny, how'd you feel now that you swallowed? It was too chocolatey. Mm. You know what I mean? And you speak on that because that's interesting. With chocolate, you kind of want it to be, and I like a milk chocolate. Mm. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not afraid of the hipsters out there who think that milk chocolate is bad to have. Yeah. Well, do you like Nesquik or do you like powder mixed with milk? Or you who? You're talking about a chocolate no, milk, no. right? What are you talking about? I'm no. talking about just like, like a milk chocolate like flavor. No <laughs> not a chocolate milk. I milk chocolate. Oh, I, I will say. Chocolate. So I had this uh, my birthday party recently. Mm, okay. And uh, <laughs> okay, 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 here we go. And we bought a bunch of Kirkland Signature chocolate milks. Ooh. Oh. And I have been sipping on those recently, and I gotta tell you, it hits really good. Mm -hmm. Really? It's was nice. it for? The, was there a lot of kids there? Was it for adults? <laughs> Hannah Montana. Were you watching Hannah Montana? <laughs> <laughs> And back to the Hannah Montana thing. So I was probably in middle school when I was watching Hannah Montana. What? You were a freshman in high school? Yeah, I was too old for that shit. You were too, only, you're only two years older than me. I no, also I wasn't watching it, but I was I was six years older than you. So I'd... I was literally so Wait worried about what people finding it out that I was, it come out? I was hiding under my <laughs> sheets. Here's what I'll say. It's a great show. It's good. It's funny, and especially in the later seasons. she's a child in the first one. It's like you yeah, sort of like- Yeah, the first one, her acting is like- Second season, be her acting is better. Second season's good. I, I think the writing's nice. Really. So. Yeah, because Miley Cyrus is probably 32, 31. Yeah, yeah. so yeah, I was she might young. be. Tw no, she, she had that song that came out. This she used Younger. to be young. Yeah, now it's actually a really beautiful she, song. I really like it. So at least hell. we know she's not young. <laughs> well, it wasn't what she it had was. The song like, come out. I used to be. Younger. <laughs> <laughs> is that what it is? Well, yeah, I think she might say her age in one of the lyrics, but I don't remember. I don't have it verbatim. She's like. She's, it's about how she used to be younger. She's not anymore. Do we take bets on it and then whoever's right gets Yeah. Okay. Cool. I think she's 30. <laughs> no, I think she's 33. I think you're right. But I just remember that I was age appropriate when I watched. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, and I definitely wasn't too adult. I it. agree because I think that I watched it because I couldn't, I didn't have TV. Well, here's so the thing I though, Rainy. You saying, you saying that you watched it. No, but I watched it a few years late because I didn't okay. have TV. So it's until worse. I got Netflix. <laughs> Wow. Whenever Netflix came out, we got Netflix. I watched it on Netflix. Yeah, it was see, yeah, Rainy, this Are is like young? not helping my case young? because Netflix no. didn't exist when I watched it. <laughs> this is not helping your case because I literally Netflix wasn't around. I was doing a block. I know, but you're three years older Rainy. than me. You're the three years older than me. Am I only four. three? Four. How you're old four. are you? 26? I'm twenty six, but you I'm just 30. turned. 30. I just turned thirty. You're twenty six. Yeah. Wow. But I just yeah. remember well, how old you think on I iTunes. Like? Sorry, I have no, to try the owl cake pie. Let's try the owl cake pie in Miles' mouth. Okay, here we go. Yours didn't, yours didn't look as big as ours was in our mouth, for, by far. Oh, that's a big one. Wings, man. 
It's an owl. <laughs> it really does. It blows up. It goes from like a size small to like it's you know. It, you really drawers. think like this can't be that big, but then it's you realize there's no air in it at all. It's completely the most it's dense like, thing. And it just spreads icing. all yeah. over your it's mouth. All icing. Are you guys all thinking it, the cake pops are too big? Because in my opinion, the cake pops are actually too small. I would like one bigger. Well, for oh. a one bite, <laughs> you thought you'd want a one bite. Yeah, something bigger. You kind of down to that. No, no, you no, down no, that. No, not not for one bite. You're right. Can I, just, can I be honest? <laughs> Keith, you know what so I'd like, Keith, high. is if the cake pop was the same consistency as your lemon loaf. Mm. I'd like it, but a cake. The problem <laughs> is that the cake pop is a consistency of wax. Yeah, it's uh, like the yeah. most. It's the most dense thing in the world. There's the owl flavoring denser. was not There's my favorite. There's nothing denser. I can't imagine the, the owl, owl flavor. Yeah, owl flavor what was, was it? a like, little. It does taste like birthday cake, probably. Well, mine is the birthday cake too, and it's just not that. good. <laughs> Guys, and I, I hate to speak for Keith, but it seems like he's ready for it to have yeah, loaf. Because Keith. Keith, by the way, as we were talking, portioned up the lemon loaf. He's waiting politely, but he, he is ready to have Okay, it. well, Keith, you you obviously want the one with icing. So Actually, I don't. You really? don't want that one? No. I, I mean, want, he's not really not a sweet sweetie. person. Yeah. I want plain. Cookie, after the cake pop, I want plain. <laughs> I want plain. <laughs> okay, so we get icing? Yeah, you so, get icing. <laughs> okay, so you, you get the most but icing. But that's how you, you know want. it's cake and Maybe, not bread. Do you bread. want icing or not? No, not really. You do not ice bread. Typically. No, see. What about yeah? No, I the holla, I guess sometimes. I'm trying to iced. poke holes in your theory. Yeah, no, I get it. Right. Johnny Loaf. Johnny, Johnny Loaf, Loaf not, is... doesn't have the same ring. Doesn't, and I get why you didn't Cheers. pick that. Cheers. 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 Uh oh. Oh. Shit in my fucking dick. That's crazy though. That fast. Um, I gotta park in a. Uh, I, I have to park in the shade now. Everyone lean in. Okay, we're back. Visuals we're back. up. Visuals up. The lemon cake. Here we go. Mm -hmm. It's a little artificial, I think, and oh, I hate yeah. to say that. <laughs> this is a problem that I've been wanting to talk about for a while. Mm -hmm. A lot of lemon flavors taste like lemon zest, and they don't taste like lemon. You to know me, what I'm it tastes about? like lemon, like mop cleaner, like palm, uh -huh. like um, palm olive, like a Lysol. Like, Lysol. 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 Miles, you're kind of really giving reporter. Mm. Of, you. Like, you know, you're on the case about the lemon artificial flavoring. Mm. Yeah, well, I, I, I want to say that I'm probably the most trusted voice <laughs> in entertainment. <laughs> in, in, in entertainment I in feel general. like, let's do a quick news report. Yeah, um, thank you, Rainy. We are out here in the Chuck E. Cheese parking lot, and we could not be more excited. We're here standing with none other than Johnny Cakes. <laughs> standing here. <laughs> we are standing here, sitting in a car with none other than Johnny Cakes. And I got to say, Johnny... Like, here's the thing. I mean, I actually do have a question about this. Yeah. And everyone's been asking, they've been tweeting in, mm. you make a lot of cake. Mm -hmm. Do all the cakes taste nice? No. Because the thing is, next question. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Thank you. The answer yes or no. <laughs> yeah, what is it? What's the thing? So, like, if I'm making a cake that, like, is a little cake. It's your camera. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is our great shot. <laughs> so this is our cute shot. I did not value credit scores, and then I married Becky, and she is a credit whiz, and showed me just how important it was to have a good credit score, because you may think a credit score is no big deal, but if you're dealing with a low credit score or no credit score at all, that could be a problem for your future financial goals. That's why millions of people swear by Chime Secured Credit Builder Visa Credit Card. Credit Builder is just a better way to build credit. You build your credit score safely with everyday purchases and on-time payments, plus there's no annual fee or credit check to get started. You can use it everywhere Visa credit cards are accepted, and you're building credit using your own money. You get paid up to two days earlier as well with a Chime checking account with a qualifying direct deposit. You get access to your money sooner. Chime has no monthly, minimum balance, or overdraft fees. Your credit is a big deal, so build yours with Chime. Just open a Chime checking account with $200 plus qualified direct deposit to get started. Get started at Chime.com slash TryGuys. That's Chime.com slash TryGuys. The Chime Credit Builder Visa credit card is issued by Stride Bank N.A., member FDIC. Chime checking account and $200 qualifying direct deposit required to apply. Out of network ATM withdrawal fees may apply. On-time payment history may have a positive impact on your credit score. Late payment may negatively impact your credit score. Results may vary. Okay, so if I'm making a cake that's like small and I know only I'm going to eat or like maybe I'll bring it to like my friends when we watch Survivor tomorrow night. Yeah. Oh, okay, more It'll on that be later. Like, it, and this is an exclusive. <laughs> I've never told this before, okay? It'll be just like a box cake. Like, I'll just make it out of a box because, like, why would I spend the time and ingredients and money on all that shit? Yeah. But yeah, most of my cakes are sizable enough that I'm bringing it to, like, an event with, like, multiple people. Gookie, and in that case, I'm Armani. not going to do 
Betty Crocker, oh, yeah. I'm gonna home home make it, home mm. home bake a cake. So <laughs> that's interesting because I feel like I would want. I, I'm more concerned with the opinions of my close friends, my Survivor crew. No, fuck my. So they, they get so you. much free. They are so. They're they so get lucky. so much cake. Yeah. Okay. I see. And now I have. Now, <laughs> well, okay. I'm trying to. <laughs> I'm trying to say this without like it sounding like I'm trying to plug something. No. Oh, by the way, plug, plug away. Plug plug. I now have plug, my plug. own cake mix. So I'll use that sometimes. Oh yeah, you're selling your own cake mix. That's genius, oh. by the way. It's it's a bowl. Get ready to buy a fucking houseboat, Johnny, because <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna live on the river now <laughs> as you float towards success. Imagine trying to bake <laughs> cakes on a, a houseboat. It's like it's just like the shaking. Cake's, it's like trying to bake. It's trying to like really good solidify content, or whatever. That would be good. I mean, speaking of Survivor, so I've been mm. recently thinking about <laughs> reality shows that are dead, that are dying. Oh, you think and Survivor? I don't get too... you think Survivor's dying. It's got such a. Crazy well, I had a friend who worked on the most recent season, so. <laughs> no, I actually don't think Survivor is dying because the fan base is so Fervent. strong. Yeah. Well, they also, are enthusiastic. They had a resurgence during COVID. Oh. They put them on. No, I get what you mean, Rainy, and mm-hmm. I think that's a really good point. But um, oh, sorry, sorry. No, to no, I didn't have anything else. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, for example, Dancing with the Stars. How do we feel? Is it dying or not dying? Mama, I've never heard of it. Who's on it? No, I've heard of it, but I haven't heard of it. Who's on recently. it right now? Is are they doing I, a story? Ariana, one of the one of the Ariana people Grande. from Scandal. One, one of the people, yes, yeah, Scandal. Oh, oh. Scandal. A, 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 the girl who is on Vanderpump and Tom cheated on her, hmm. and now she's living her best life. And she's she's making, dancing she got her way a book to the top. Deal. She's dancing her way to the top, baby. Mm. Yeah. You know how and people say? Oh, I'm sorry. I Keith. don't watch the show because I don't really care if people who are already fairly famous learn to dance. <laughs> I'm just thinking of the funniest people to be, who could be on Dancing with the Stars. Yeah, I wish that the the stars that they chose to dance were way funnier choices rather than just like yeah. they're mostly just people who have been on reality shows yeah. or they're like other good-looking people from somewhere else yeah. in the history of TV. Don't they also kind of do like people who were canceled? Is that true? Yeah, like Scaramucci was on it. Yeah, which is so embarrassing. Like yeah. fucking get out of here. You know what I mean? Remember when Sarah Palin was on um The Masked Singer? Oh, and like the yeah, uh, somebody else, and then like people walked out because they're like, "This is crazy." Uh, the, I don't remember that. Um, she was a singer, Sarah. Sarah. <laughs> I kind of want to be on Max Sarah Masks Lisa. Singer. Yeah, that you singer should be. Wait, funny. Keith, you, you'd be you great sing, on though, it. So you'd be great. I know, but I don't know if they would. Would they be able to know it's me? Yes, like, it's for Keith. sure. Would anyone, would anyone care when they took when I took my head yes. off that you it know was what? Keith? I actually yes. wonder about this. Do they ever not know? Or do they like kind of brief them on like? Like, are the judges ever like, who? Will they, they give them clues? They're always yeah. guessing. And do they lose when you find out, or do they lose because they're bad at singing? How's, right. the, how's the show work? They, you lose because <laughs> you're bad at singing, I think. Ah, so I don't know what they don't get. About. You don't find out who you are until you've lost because people think you're bad. Mm. Oh, because you're not singing enough. Not, seem- not like, I know that's Keith. And you're like, ding, 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 it was Keith. Keith, you lose because you didn't fool him with your singing. Mm. We should do some more testing, more more cookie testing. Cookie cake testing. testing. <laughs> cake testing. By the way, yeah, Keith, let's head, to, let's head to Starbucks. Wow, we finished our cake from uh, Starbucks, and now we got to go to McDonald's. Do we rate them? Because supposedly- Yeah, we rate them. Great ad. Johnny, that is a good, because wow. this, is, and this is something <laughs> I learned from Zach. You always want to add a reveal oh. in each YouTube video. Good job, Zach. So I would rate that, and I hate to say it, uh, three. Wait, out of what? <laughs> out of ten. Oh my God, really? Three out of ten. Really? No. Rainy. Five being average. What's ten it's, out of ten? I think 10. it's a little worse than average. Name a cake that you've had that's ten wow. out of ten, though. Like, so we know the baseline of what Rainy's judging is. Is the cake uh, ten out of ten? The like- Great Wall of Chocolate from P.F. Chang's. I'm not kidding. <gasps> but, wait, really? Oh. The best cake. The Great Wall of Chocolate. Or, or, or the Triple Berry. This is more like elitist, but the Triple Berry cake from um, <laughs> Nobu. Nobu. No, from uh, Sweet Lady Jane. <laughs> Sweet Lady Green, what's that? Jane. <laughs> Sweet Lady Jane? Yeah. Who's that? You don't know Sweet Lady Jane, you guys? No. no. It's like a WeHo spot. I mean, um, yeah, I don't know, but... <laughs> you've had it. You've had it. You've had it. It's at every LA wedding. Oh. It's the triple berry cake. No one knows? Wait, look, Johnny, I think that you're thinking that we're thinking about the cake more than we are. No, I but you, I've heard of it. you go to weddings, and it's at every wedding in LA. It's sort of like when a fishmonger's like, you guys don't know about the new bass. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Yeah, it's kind of like that. That's such a good point. Every you don't know, farmer's market in LA. Every farmer's market in LA, they knew <laughs> salmon just dropped. So and expert expert Johnny, though, yeah. what's your rating? Well, just know I'm just like you. I'm one of the people. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want my opinion to trump other people, because the thing about cake is like it's a... It's like a, it's like the people's it's communal. food. It's yeah, communal. the people's Is food. it? Do you think? Definitely. It's not. 
It's not I like think a, rice is the people's food. Well, it's the people's dessert. <laughs> Let them eat cake. <laughs> Let them eat rice. <laughs> it's the people's dessert. It's not like creme brulee. You know, it's not like shishi. It's creme brulee, cake. more like. Right, exactly. Thank you. Well, now, cre- creme brulee LA, right. I mean, would be actually a good spot to put in the mall. <laughs> creme brulee LA. <laughs> So and maybe brew could be B R E W. Sorry, yeah. Randy, go on. <laughs> it's also a coffee app. Okay. Um, so, what's your rating out of ten? Uh, I would say uh, five out of ten. We're in a really long. Um, <laughs> we're not going to go to McDonald's, guys. But the Pikachu Happy Meal. Maybe back. we could go to a less populated one. I guys, I think that now is a good as time as any. But do you think I could pull off a low pony? <laughs> <laughs> yes. And yeah. I guess I. <laughs> I feel like I've been buttering up the whole episode to ask. <laughs> you've been that's why you've been so nice that's today. That's why I've been so <laughs> nice to everyone. But my hair's a little bit long. Zach kept saying it was greasy and that's why he's not on the show anymore. <laughs> but, <laughs> so why not man bun? Is my question cuz man bun well, yes. Well, first of all, first man of all, bun it's assumes bun. it's a bun. We don't want to gender the bun rainy rainy's canceled. <laughs> but <laughs> it's just a bun on a man. No different than a bun on, on a, a lady. lady. Oh. Now, the question is, oh my God, somebody just that swerved at Keith. Us. That was crazy. <laughs> that was his answer to shoot you get a yeah. low pony. <laughs> and he said, nope. But um, the question is, I just sort of feel like my hair is kind of flouncing mm. on the bottoms. And I'm wondering mm. if I pull off a low pony, if that would change my whole that aesthetic. stop the flounce. But that's kind of hot, the flounce. The why, flounce. why stop it? I know. Is I just it annoying? Some, sometimes I feel like it makes me feel like I'm not a businessman. Oh, uh, okay. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. While we figure out where the McDonald's is, yeah, I'm going to get actually... gasoline at our favorite $7. Moldovan. Seven dollars oh. for gas. That and is guess crazy. what? I'm getting premium. He wow. gets that premium good good for his really. Follow. I have to. But no. I bet there's there's Moldovan cake surely inside, right? Oh my God! We're going to need the company card and Rainy and w- Rainy's going to go and J- J- Johnny's going to be in the hot seat while Keith mm-hmm. gets gas. Yeah. Okay. It's going to be a mild and Johnny exclusive. That's uh-huh. right. Um, and there's no air. We could suffocate. Oh, yeah. Keith turned off the car because you're not supposed to fuel the car the when car. it's on. Right, right, right. Because otherwise the car could explode. And that I would be, that. if we if we died in a gas fire, it would be really a bummer for Philip DeFranco to break the news. But I do think that the episode would do really well. You think it would do well if we died in a gas fire, sort of um, <laughs> on the company, for the company? For the company. <laughs> okay. Johnny, just watch these numbers and say if, okay, wait, if they the, say Johnny's s- running sound. No, 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 no. You don't even have to. You don't have to. Just, just every once in a while, gun sound. If it's, it's going up, then it's good. Now, Johnny, yep. how, what, what's your what, what's going on? What's new? Mm. You know, you're Thanks. making cakes. <laughs> Last time we spoke, actually, was on. I mean, native plug while everyone's gone. Yeah, my podcast. Let's just plug shit. Let's just plug, plug shit. Okay, what else plug can shit. Okay. Everyone Follow go Miles to the mall. On. Miles buy Bond. iPhone <laughs> cases. <laughs> buy the iPhone cases. <laughs> everyone go to the mall kiosk. No. Um, last time we talked, we, yep. talk, we were talking about... Um, oh, it's getting warm in here. Right? It's getting hot, by the way. Oof. You know that isn't it a dog can die in 30 seconds in a hot car? Woof, woof. Woof, woof. But um, I was curious. So <laughs> you're making cakes <laughs> that look like other stuff. Yep. And you were lamenting about the fact yes. that it's like, where do you go from there? Oh, yeah, he's back. Oh, there we go. Hey, Careful. Keith. I saw 2020 that you can static shock your way to an explosion. Do you know about this? Yeah, but typically that happens in the winter. Okay, thank God. Wait, did that happen to someone? They static shocked into an explosion? If you have like carpeted seats or whatever, like fabric seats, when you get out, you get static shocked. Then when you touch the pl- the gas that's pumping, it sparks it and the has car sets ha- on fire. Has that happened? Yes, they showed it on the 2020 like multiple times. Yeah, but it happens more in the winter because it's dry and everyone's wearing a lot more staticky stuff. Has that happened in real life? No, no I, I'll show you compilations. I- you, you have compilations. <laughs> who's, who's rolling on that? Rainy's here. Oh, Rainy's back. <laughs> but I, oh, it was so. If I keep this door closed, we're gonna die. Uh, well, it's that's why I said a dog can die in thirty seconds in a hot car. Thirty seconds. Uh, Rainy, how did it go in there? So I got two things. Obviously, the classic. Mm. And Maldovan. by the way, this was the very last one. Maldovan friends. And I'm concerned it might be the last one ever. So we better save these. We'll put them in a time capsule. Next, I got these because these. There was this guy outside my high school. And he was like an adult, but he sold he an these. And he, he was a guy, he was a creepy like guy waiting outside your high school to give the kids treats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and he would drown them in the, that like Valentino salsa yeah. mm. and lime juice. Mm. Valentino so- hot sauce. And he was a guy, but he was an adult. <laughs> He's an adult and man he, who was selling. So he was just. But I haven't really. Vendor. So I'm like, okay, well, let's see if these hold up. Obviously, they don't have the flavor. That so these are obviously did. not from Moldova. These are from uh, my uh, high school. From where are you from? <laughs> Denver. Wow. <laughs> these are from Denver. <laughs> these are from Denver. No, but these are going to be. I'm. I'm seeing if they're going to be a trip down memory lane, or if they're not. No, okay. Uh, no, they had no other Moldovan snacks. No, only these. And you this was the, the last. Same? I'm telling you, the last bag. Like the I took a photo. Yeah. Wow. You felt we like we had to get it again. I thought. 
I, you told me. You, <laughs> you basically sent her on a mission to get more cakes. Well, I, I sent her on a mission to get cake. If we're, re- if we're reviewing cake and the people don't see us review Moldovan cake, which is basically the Moldovan Franzaluda. But, but is this a different flavor? Or no, it's it? the same. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Only one wow. single one. I was it told used to be covered there was a whole, whole section of Moldovan treats That's multiple times. We did Rain. think, yes, we did think that there was going to be like a Moldovan pie in there, yeah. but unfortunately there wasn't. And I think the only <laughs> thing we have to do is contact the Moldovan tourism board and do an episode in Moldova. <laughs> would be interesting. It would be quite the flight. I think it's like 24 straight hours. It's very far. It's like it's on the opposite side of the world, to be honest. Okay, so let's try whatever these high school... Let's try Rainy's high school snacks. Now, these are um, definitely not from El Wagon wheels. Oh, you were very polite. I just took one in. Oh, I don't like the smell. Smells like nothing. All right. Okay. Visual. Mm Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, yeah. Because... Okay, so this is taking me down memory lane. No flavor. Hmm. It sort of tastes like... um, like mm. enough, it's sort of enough. This is so good. <laughs> this is Rainy this is actually making me really glowing, happy. <laughs> by the way, Rainy just like did like an oh, this is so good. It was so kid. Mm-hmm. You, it was like you had candy for the first time. You really like these? No, well, I don't think they're good, but it is. It really is reminding me of like a soccer game mm-hmm. and like soccer practice and, and like being with my friend. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Well, now I'm thinking about a different guy okay. who I was eating these with. Oh. The texture, when it, imagine it having a thick Valentino salsa creeping into the side. See, I don't want to, like, make light of this, but there's a sign next to us that said, and it's for <laughs> Shell, it's for Shell's charity campaign, and it is called the Giving Pump, <laughs> and I just don't I, think that that's appropriate. It's Giving Pump. It's Giving Pump. <laughs> the Giving Pump, and there's pictures of children on it. <laughs> Fill up here and help out our local kids. <laughs> I don't think <laughs> the giving pump is appropriate, really. These you're... are good. I'm eating more. Thank you, Johnny. What are those called, Rainy? R-U-E-D-I-T-A-S. Okay, I thought those, those were really nice, actually. Ruiditas. Ruiditas. Well, basically... I thought they were too spicy. Yeah. I didn't have enough flavor That's outside right. of the spice. Thank you, Keith. <laughs> no, I agree. And I'll, oh, my gosh, by the way. Sorry, Keith. That was my bad. That's why I'm screaming. I love it. <laughs> I hope that would get picked up. No, that's a really good point, Keith. Oh, my God. The Burbank Empire Center, my favorite. How I'm are you holding this right for like a knife? You're going to stab it in my throat. <laughs> are like you that. actually, do you, do you like that place? The Burbank Empire so, si- Center, me, which, by the way. Let me tell you something. Yeah. The Burbank Empire Center is my favorite place in LA. What isn't there? There is a TJ Maxx. An REI. There is a Marshalls. There is a Michaels. There is a Lowe's. There is a Krispy Kreme. And of course, there is an Olive Garden. Yeah, but the vibe in mm. there is weird. No, I, there I, is a Staples. There is a David's <laughs> Bridal. There is an REI. There is a West Elm if you're feeling fancy. The Olive mm. Garden I've been to a number of times, and it always smells a little like urinal cakes. What? There's just a point in the Olive Garden. Maybe we're sat It's a point there, in every Olive Garden's life where it smells, when like, it smells like <laughs> urinal cakes. Well, no, we went in there, and I've been there twice, and the first time I thought that it was a f- like some sort of family nearby that was maybe like somebody had farted. But no, I will say that I do love Olive Garden, and I agree that that little shopping center is kind of weird. I love it, but it is hard to navigate around. It's very crowded. It's very popular, <laughs> but we love it, Bob. I wanna, I wanna um, move to Burbank just so I can. I'm not being funny. I know this is hilarious stuff I'm saying, but <laughs> I want to move to Burbank so I can be close to the Burbank Empire Center because I go to Michael's like three times a week. I go to Olive Garden. A couple- <laughs> you go to Michael's three times a week. Is it for the cakes, Johnny? For the cakes. Olive Garden, though, not a couple times a week, but I, I regularly. I. Uh, that Target is a great Target. I like yeah, they have Target. I didn't even mention Target. <laughs> you are reporting live. <laughs> the way that you're talking is... I, re- I like to think that I'm a contestant on The Price is Right right now. Yeah, I like that. That's a great Target, Bob. <laughs> I think that's a good Target, and I'm excited to go later. Now, Johnny, so mm. when when I last talked to you, you were on You Can Sit With Us. Yep. And I don't know... Literally, you can't be like, I don't want to talk about this. Yeah, yeah. But you were, go, you had a little fling going. Yes. And I'm fling. wondering a check in on Ooh, that. Oh, Johnny, yeah, a fling? little fling. Well, it was a resurgence of a of a former romance. Oh, wow. Which is kind of the best. I mean, I like that. Some, Johnny especially dates. Especially Johnny dates. There we go, wow. Miles. Johnny dates. Johnny dates. Um, it went well. Yeah, he was here for a month and a half, and we. The it thing was is, finite. we like talk all the time. Like it's not, it's not like one of those. Ooh, no, I'm gonna see my ex. What's he gonna yeah. look or sound like? You know what I mean? Oh, <laughs> what's he gonna look like? <laughs> what's he gonna sound well, like? Well, remember when you forget how people look sometimes? Or you yeah. do actually, and a haircut yeah. can change a lot. Oh yeah. I just saw a tweet the other day that was like, when you think of something, do you see it? Like, do you visualize it in your head? Do you see this? Oh, because some, yeah. some people don't. Some people. Do. <laughs> 
you see yes. it? I do. Do you? Okay, like everyone think about um, an apple. An apple. A picture. Oh yeah, definitely. See do it. you picture. see the apple? Yes. Yes. Yeah. A Some lot people of people don't. don't. They see black, like, abyss, I think. Yeah, they, 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 they think of the word apple. apple? That's, uh, that's just scary. <laughs> remember when we were kids <laughs> and we were watching Hannah Montana? Yeah. Remember, remember how they would bring out, why don't they do this anymore, a, a tray of all the desserts to show you what the desserts look like. Wait. That happens at nice Italian restaurants. Oh. Yeah, like in my mind, to, it uh, happened at every restaurant in the 90s and no restaurants in 2020. If you go to Maggiano's Little Italy, they are piping the desserts out, showing them to you and okay. saying, howdy. Oh, Keith just found a really nice McDonald's. Oh my God, Keith, what a nice McDonald's you found. <laughs> yeah, thanks. So. This one's <laughs> really Where nice. Where are we? Are we in Burbank? We are sort We're of by the, the Burbank Airport. airport. Ah. The wow. best, the best airport it's in yeah, the, best I wish. the world. Literally. I <laughs> The, I've no, never flown yeah. out of it. You oh, have never? No. Oh, Johnny, you're Johnny missing out. But I used to be a Lyft driver, so I take people here all the Whoa. time. I was you a did? terrible, terrible Lyft driver. Wait, when oh you were a Lyft driver, were you like, um, so like, hey, what's going on with your life? Like, yeah. You, oh, yeah, I was chatty. You, you know were chatty? Me. I drove... I drove Mandy Moore once, and I didn't know it was her because her name was Amanda. No. And I was like talking. I was like, why does this woman sound like fucking Rapunzel from Tangled? And then I was like, oh, oh she looks gosh. like, I was like, she looks like Mandy Moore, but her name's Amanda, so it can't be her. And then it Hello. like hit me. Oh, that's not me. That, okay, no worries. You drove Mandy Moore yeah, in a lift? she was lift? really nice. There was a big crash next to us, and she was very concerned for all parties involved. Aww. She said, oh, no. She was like, <laughs> oh, and she like looked behind her, and I was like, oh, my God, this is, this is Amanda Moore. Okay, I've got, <laughs> I've got precious cargo. And as soon as I, I was on the 101, like I was on the highway when I realized it was her, and I panicked, and I forgot how to drive. She didn't I was take like, like an Uber oh. Black? Yes, you... Well, I mean, were well, you how do you know black? I wasn't driving yeah, an Keith. Uber Black? I know I you, you I have to have a certain kind of car. What kind of car is it? It's like a black SUV. It has to be like very, no, very... No, she took a normal. A very She's nice. just stars. They're just, like, just us. like us. She's just like us. Were you like, oh, this is us? Like you pulled up. <laughs> you pulled up to the location. You said, this is us. I said, this is us. <laughs> This is us. <laughs> this is us. You can hop out. That's good. This is us. You can hop out. I love. And then I went more. into the restaurant with. Like, her. I, think, I actually do too. I think she's like one of the best celebrities. Period. She's, she was very like nice IRL. You know who else was nice IRL? Oh. IRL. <laughs> We're just naming celebrities. Did you, now. These people you drove? Yeah, because I okay before I was making cakes, I was like really struggling at like acting. Yeah. So I had us, every right? job. You know. Yeah, you. That? Yeah. They're not waiting on us, right? Oh, because we're like talking. She's so interested much. in my Mandy Moore story. <laughs> no, sorry, no, we, we are waiting at the McDonald's window, and I think that they're just—I think they'll let us know when they're ready. Kate. I just don't want to. I don't want them because we're talking loud, no, I and think I think they, maybe they don't want to interrupt. <laughs> hey, hey! I'm pretty sure they interrupt. Well, we're about to order a whole ass cake, so they're gonna get excited about that. I think they they're gonna be cheering back in the kitchen, Keith. I don't think they're. I'm. I'm, I'm oh, so we gotta get a. Oh my okay. God, the McFlurry. I have a, a question for you, and it's okay if the answer is no. Do you guys have birthday cake? Don't. We don't. Do you have any cake? No, I'm sorry. What is the cake most cake like thing you think you have? Like Just a the pie, a McDouble, and a, <laughs> a spicy chicken nugget. Can, can we get um a McDouble? <laughs> And a spicy chicken nuggets. Okay, a McDouble is a cake if you think about and, it. And um, <laughs> the apple good. pie. John, yeah, all the pie's good. <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> Why are you whispering? I don't, I don't want them to hear. Thank you. <laughs> Anyone get fries? We didn't get fries, but that's okay. We're going to go <laughs> Burger King or something. Yeah, but so McDonald's. that was really interesting, Keith. Yeah, no, no cake. <laughs> That was tough. I felt that they were out of almost everything <laughs> on the menu. Yeah. Also, the McFlurry was crossed out. The the shakes were, like, they didn't have many things. No, a burger is a cake. That's why I got it's the McDouble. It's a savory cake. It's layers. There's, there's a cheese drip down the side. <laughs> Johnny Burgers, honestly. <laughs> yeah, a and burger I'm, is a cake. And I'm wondering, yeah, mm. like, would you ever do the reverse? Like, I made a... <laughs> I made a burger that looked like a cake. That's a great idea. But like, I made a cake that looked like holy a burger. Shit, that well, I know, such a good idea. Because I know you've made cakes <laughs> that look like burgers. What? Because obviously you've done that. Oh, I see where you're at. You're I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I see where you're at. Can I make a burger that looks like you a cake? Yes, I made, I put like the, I made a genius. Thanksgiving meal cake. It was a savory cake. It was cornbread layers, mashed no, no, no. potato frosting. What he's saying is a cake that looks like a birthday cake. It's not a cake. It looks like a cake. It is Thanksgiving dinner. Oh, but but well, but there's some there's some cake in there. Where's their cake? I don't know. Cornbread. No, cornbread. cornbread is not. No, it was. Wait a minute. Hang on. Cornbread is cake. Hang on. It was, no, is it is not. Is it made of a batter? Wait, is that the so only. It, 
Is anything with a batter cake? It's closer than a bread. It's, it's not a, a donut. No, but let me tell you what else I did, okay? Let me tell you what else I did. No, Johnny. I shredded up turkey and put it in between the layers and cranberry sauce and mac and cheese, and then I frosted it with mashed potatoes and did a drip, you know, like a, a drip or down a cake. It was it was gravy. Johnny, you're scaring the McDonald's. <laughs> okay, so the gravy is an icing. The cranberry sauce yeah. is an icing. Okay, then everything's everything by that logic. No, I Matter actually, cannot be created or I, destroyed. I appreciate the turkey being not cake. And neither was the cranberry sauce. I feel like also neither was the mashed and potatoes, and I hate to, no, I no, hate to I, disagree I, with my bosses. No, I'll say that. Well, I'm not your boss, boss anymore. Um, I'm just a guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a guy who ordered a McDouble on the company. I kind of need a feud with someone. Need you, what's feud, that? I need a feud with someone. Do you, want it, do you want it to be you? Ooh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't believe you feud with anybody. Oh, oh, you'd be surprised. <laughs> really? You'd be surprised. Rainy has some enemies. They change. I know we have some nemeses. They change on a week-by-week -week basis. Who? Let's just name ourselves. Can name we just, like, bleep their names out? Let's see. Other YouTubers? I Do mean, you Kathy. going to be able to turn this corner? No. Um, no so but are you I, feuding with somebody named Kathy? I was in college. So, so in college. 50 yeah. years or older, right? She's, like, an older woman? Uh, no. Why? A young no. Kathy? I've never met a young Kathy. Hasn't she suffered enough, Rainy? <laughs> <laughs> Um, no, but I'm just thinking, like, okay, honestly, me and Johnny could have a good feud. What about? Johnny feuds? Johnny feuds. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny's okay. That, um, that's, that's good. Let's fight. Yeah. Johnny, do you, yeah, well, here's a question. Do you have any enemies? In no, oh, I, th I thought oh, of a perfect go. one. Yeah. Will. I think I should start a feud with Will. Oh, I think that's good. Yeah. I like that. I like that energy. I like that yeah. sass. Thank um, you so much. Okay, well, we have a Either couple one. different cakes to try. <laughs> we have just a few cakes to try. We're going to see if Keith can make this turn with his uh, uh, car. It's a little tight of a turn, and you pulled it off. And I did it. We should have gotten a filet fish That's the cake of the sea. Oh. <laughs> I, I actually kind of like filet fish No, I've heard you say that before, and it's shocking to me, but I guess every fish must have its day. It's surprisingly <laughs> decent. Um, <laughs> Not as good as the what a fish from Whataburger. What a fish. I've never been to Whataburger. It's good. Um, so we have the, of course, baked McCafe apple pie, mm. caution hot. Mm. It was You have to enjoy it by 4.35 p.m., it says. Today? <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize that. No. Enjoy by 4.35 Wait, p.m. so soon. Or That's otherwise, like I think it's because it gets hot. So if it gets hot and it cools down, it's a germ nightmare. That shouldn't be the way. That shouldn't be the way. You're correct. But um, I feel like with this one, we all take a bite of a corner. Okay, I've never had one actually. Now also, this is from it a doesn't box, say to eat it. Like... It says to enjoy it by then. So it's just it's not letting it's letting you know that after that, it's <laughs> probably not enjoyable. <laughs> it's see. not going to be enjoying it much. I see. At all. So okay. Ooh. Ooh, goopy. Now nice and goopy, nice and gooey. Um, loopy. I'm wondering if I just sort of okay. Oh, here we fun. go. Keith. Uh oh. Keith. We're gonna make a mountain out of a molehill here. It looks like a spinal column. Yeah. That's be I feel like I could sticky. see. Oh. oh. What? Oh. Okay. Uh. Give me a small piece, because honestly. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'll take that. <laughs> okay, we can all take a bite of the oh, sorry, McDonald's cake. Apple cake. Oh. Man, even worse than the cake pop, I say. What? I disagree. Delicious. Rainy, mm -mm, I gotta I say, that's, a com that's an uncommon Rainy L. I'm taking a Rainy on this. What? <laughs> Me and the professional. Johnny is a dessert Wait, professional. He I mean, didn't like it. Speak on that, because I feel like the cake pop was like oh, icing, sugar, sweet. And I, this I kind of like that, that there's a little bit of a, a crusty savor. Um, I thought that it was, it has a really weird aftertaste. It also is really bad pastry. I mean, I know it's McDonald's and we can't like get in the weeds here. But it's yeah. like, there's nothing flaky or buttery about it. Yeah, it's kind of just like. <laughs> there's nothing flaky or buttery about it. And that's on McDonald's apple pie. Yeah. I mean, I agree with that. But I just think that the, you know what it was? It's that it was warm. Oh, well, the warm did, it gave many ups. But we didn't have a chance to warm up the cake pops. Can I tell you, though, I don't think you can warm up cake pops, can you? Is it just too much icing? Yeah, so it'll, it'll, it would it'll just get melt. I think it would melt. And melt and burn. Okay, so I, what I did is I drove to a parking lot of a 7 <gasps> Eleven, thinking maybe there's a cake oh, there. Oh, definitely. You I know? love 7 Eleven. Yeah, no, I, I agree with that, Keith. Now, before we get into. <laughs> what, the, what the hell is going on with this nugget box? This is a tiny little thing. Are you going to propose That's to me? That's cute. Yeah. <laughs> I do. <gasps> I do too. I have nuggets. So we also got the chicken cake chicken from McDonald's. Cake. <laughs> no, 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 no. Since cake when pop. did they cake pops? This is called size inflation. This is when a company this is when you charges pump, the you same do, put price. A dip penis pump. Well, no, <laughs> no. This is when a company 
changes the size of their good but keeps the price the same. So Gatorade is notorious for this. But Wait, how they, the bottles got sexier, what they actually did was put less fluid ounces in the Gatorade. Wow. But make it look the same size. But So they keep the price the same, but actually they're giving you less food or liquid. Mm. This is what's happening here, right? The price is probably similar, but instead uh, of a five piece, it's a four piece. No. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. That's wicked. It's a wicked little. It's just every yeah. day they kind of hurt my soul a little bit. Every day they kill another small busy. Oh, Keith's trying to get in there. Is there a ranch in there? Did supersize me make you guys crave McDonald's? Unfortunately, I believe that that is the general consensus in Keith. There's no ranch. We have to go back. <laughs> <laughs> I did um, say I wanted said and Buffalo ranch. and ranch, but they also said they were out of a lot of things. Yeah. Um, well, everyone, let's get into our McDonald's cake, chicken the cake. Of get a little sea. icing. Get a little <laughs> buffalo you. icing. A little buffalo icing on the cake. Johnny, do you want icing? Sure. <laughs> icing. Thing. A little icing here. Little icing a little here. Little chicken icing cake. There. Now this looks like a chicken nugget, but it's actually cake. It's actually cake because it couldn't be. It's possibly a cupcake. It's chicken. a cupcake. Oh no, it's a cake pop. You're right. It's cake pop. Is it cake? Yeah. It's a cake. There we go. Cheers. I want you a thumbnail. Cake <laughs> <laughs> off with a bunch of nuggets. Way too late. <laughs> Is it true that there's like a thousand chickens in each nugget? <laughs> Is that I, a, there's there's a ghost of a thousand chickens in each nugget. That was not good. That's my favorite cake so far. And I hated the buffalo sauce. It tastes terrible. What? I kind of like the buffalo. I thought the buffalo sauce was the best part. No, that just goes I to thought the nugget was. You got some junk in your little beard. What kind of junk? I got it. Apple pie? I think it actually <laughs> ended up being spit. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't um, going to address it till you pressed further. Um, well, we have to try the beefcake. <laughs> <laughs> the McDonald's beefcake. The McDonald's McDouble beefcake. Double beefcake. <laughs> it's going to be delicious. <laughs> Everyone take a bite and pass it around. I'm going to say right now. You want to divide it into four I'm like the lemon? Take a bite? I don't really want it. Oh. I had a burger for lunch. Is there a lot of ketchup in it? You had a burger for There's lunch? There's probably some. Yeah. Where was the burgers I from? I just put the ketchup. <laughs> um, they're from a new place. New place. You don't know her. <laughs> oh my yeah. God, you don't know. Her. I don't know her. Literally, things have changed. Cool. Rainy, things have changed. They really changed. Don't you like going into the? Uh... <laughs> what? Rainy, here's your thumbnail. Thank you. <laughs> we try all. We try we podcast at cake restaurants. <laughs> we tried all the cakes in L.A. <laughs> we have had one cake so far, you guys. <laughs> well, we've had we barely. Want the to be special. We've for had you. four pops and a lemon loaf. So that's five. <laughs> we're just eating, which is fine, but, <laughs> but we're not getting cake. The beefcake. <laughs> no, that's really beef- good. <laughs> Just because we're calling everything cake. <laughs> <laughs> no, this the, is the new- power of gaslighting. That's a good you cake. can do. Yeah. The title is going to be "Is it cake with Johnny?" And I'm like, no, no, this one's not. No, cake. not cake. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. That's a McDouble, not cake. It's pretty good. Maybe? That's honestly, I'm good. Thank you. I can't have any of that. <laughs> no meat. <laughs> Sorry. You think you're above the McDouble? <laughs> no, it just smells something funny. It smells kind of like Southwestern, like beans or something. You want the rest of this? I know, yeah. It's I'll really, take one more. Take one more bite. <laughs> you want the good. rest of it? Well, I'm going to have one more. Man, it reminds me of home. We got to go to 7-Eleven and get yeah. a cake. Is it, now, yeah, here's a good point. We have to get a cake from 7-Eleven. <laughs> Is that possible? <laughs> I don't know. I can go with a cell phone and see how it goes. Yeah, I think you should go in and that'll be our big finale. You know what you're supposed to do? If you don't trust your friends, when you get out of the car, like they drop you off, you you hit record on your voice memos. You put it, your phone under your seat. You can do that with an AirPod. Do you know that? Oh, my God. That's so terrible. There's a way to, if you leave an AirPod in a room, you can listen to it yes. from your phone. And oh. then so you leave. You say, bye, guys. Thanks for dropping me off. We had a great night. And then you get out of the car and whatever shit they talk about you after they drop you off, you can hear it. Have that's you ever? You don't trust your friends, though. I will say in uh, when I was at camp in like sixth grade, I pretended to go to sleep and they did talk about me. Uh, wait, well, what did they say? Let's go to those girls' houses and burn them down. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't remember what they said. I don't think it was that bad, but I just remember being like noted. What He's are the names? Let's name names. Uh, I just remember the name of the camp. What was it? <laughs> Rainy is always name dropping like moments from her real life. And she's like, you guys didn't go to Southwestern Bay camps <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> No, and these weren't like these weren't people that I they, they were random camp people. Like they weren't like my friends who I went to camp with, which I did have that experience separately, but I don't think that they were talking about that me. That they were too But have you guys ever heard have you overheard people, people talking talk about you? People talking shit about me? Um you know what? Mm-mm. I just remember actually I did have a vivid memory where in college I ran with the musical theater crowd and after college, like we all <laughs> graduated, and I just remember a friend told me, like we got coffee, uh, and she was like, just so you know, 
those people are not your friends. <gasps> And I was like, nasty. and I kind of, I just, I knew that they like would, I knew that they weren't my close friends, but it, she was just like, they do not, they are not nice about Aww. you. And I was like, oh yeah, like that probably makes but sense. But you're so like, lovely and wonderful. I know, but I think that that's the thing is it's college and musical theater, I think brings out the worst in people, honestly, <laughs> socially. The theater kids. Yeah, it's like, there's lots of drama that goes on and whatever. And I just remember feeling that feeling and that was like, oh, Aww. like that's so dumb. I reached on my Instagram story. I like said like, "Hey, like, let me know your worst like text." Yeah, texting the wrong person, right? And I got <gasps> wild shit. Ooh. A lot. Of, you know what I got a lot of, which is upsetting. A lot of sending nudes to your parents or grandparents. That's a little oh, at a piddle. I feel like That's could that be an accident bad. that many times? Why? Yes, I hope so. Times. God, I hope so. Like for different people were doing it. I know, but like, like right. so many people are doing it, and not to your random friend. If I sent my parent. Either my dad or my mom, a nude. I would because it's also gonna never be, come back. It's going to be sexy too. Like it's, it's gonna not going to. It's sexy. not going to be like a sterile nude. It's going to be like you in a compromising pose, mm. for lack of a better term, mm-hmm. showing it all. Yeah, showing it all, and <laughs> and yeah. You it, know, if I, like my nude is going to be me, sort of in costume, borderline. Yeah. You know. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm curious. What kind of what are you, what nudes are you talking about? Well, obviously, Mr. Incredible. Right. <laughs> okay. So you always wear a costume. <laughs> so it's not nude. It's just me in an incredible costume. Keith. Keith, we miss you. Keith, Keith, have you ever heard of somebody sending a nude to their parent accidentally? No. Okay. <laughs> Thank. You. I. Um, I'm so sorry to change the vibe back no. to the original concept uh, okay. after hearing what you guys were talking about, but. Have I got some cakes for you? No mm. way, Keith. The cakes that I found, <gasps> I think, are the best we could possibly end this with because <sighs> they all have a similar theme, and yet you're going to be confused as to how that's possible. Wow. Oh, wow. I'm going to okay. give each of you one of these. I don't, oh. want to, I don't want you to look at the name of it <laughs> until we uh, uh, all each of you choose to say the name of yours. Thank so. you, Keith. I've received my cake, and I am not looking at it, sir. <laughs> And just say one of them has huh. Spanish or maybe another language, but just say the English words. And uh, Rainy, can you start with what yours says? Interesting. Okay, cheesecake. Johnny, what does yours say? Cheesecake. And now, Miles, what does yours say? <laughs> Cheese coffee cake. And now, can we just go ahead and put all these cakes in front of the camera to see what they look like as cheesecake? Right. Wait, sorry, no. To, yeah, <laughs> this. Is cheesecake. Oh, weird. this is cheesecake. That's so weird. It even has a picture of cheesecake on it. But it's, not. But it's pound cake. It's not, huh. cheesecake. it's not cheesecake. I'm really excited about this. Yeah, so I thought this was a really exciting innovation. All of these are cheesecake, but not cheesecake how we think of them. Mm. Yeah, that well, is I don't, really well. curious, Keith. Yeah. Now, um, who should go first? Did you get one for yourself? Or I guess there's sort of a... No, we're all going to share all of them. I just kind of wanted you to read out the names. <laughs> I like that. All right, I'll take my bite. Huge bite. Huge bite. It smells like cheesecake, though. It's got that, like, tangy... Don't eat cheese. Don't eat cheese. Ooh, this actually smells pretty good. Mm. This one's nice, you guys. <laughs> this is tastes like coffee cake. It tastes like coffee cake. With Where's hint- the cheese? I had a hint of cheese. It tastes like Danish. Give me some of your cheese. It sort of is like, is it cake, Johnny? And I'm curious about your opinion. In fact, sesame seeds like a burger, which is making McDonald's make more sense to me now. By the way, this really is giving sesame burgers. This mm. is delicious. Mm-mm-mm. This, this is, is Rainy's cheesecake. These are all sort of the same. They all taste very similar. Wait, I gotta That's... try Rainy's. They all just taste like really good pound cake. There's no cheese that I'm getting, but I am getting sort of a dankness. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like a well, dairy yeah. section. Like a, Yeah, there's like a dairy section. It's like how it smells in the grocery store when you uh-huh. walk by the cheese. Yes. Oh, yeah. It's light, but it's there. It's subtle, but it's mozzarella. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Which, I mean, which one did we like? We I think we like the, McD- the beefcake best. Yeah, wait, we didn't rank. Well, Johnny, I guess oh, you're, yeah, you're going to decide. Johnny has to decide. Okay, so, okay, so you, the one I like best is <laughs> the final one, the, the cheesecakes yeah. from 7-Eleven. Mm. Check yeah. out Johnny on Is It Cake on Netflix. <laughs> no. <laughs> that was like two years ago. <laughs> it's still there, right? <laughs> it's still there. So you Season can still- one. <laughs> Go root for him. No, Devin, thank you for plugging me. No spoilers, but he is the big winner. No spoilers, no, I, but it no, might be I, King. No, I really didn't win either. <laughs> Are you guys kidding? In fact, I was one of the first people to get kicked out. <laughs> I didn't know that. No. I, I knew that. No, because, because uh, yeah. 
Johnny, I thought you were the winner. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny was too funny, but it's not about. I him. don't know why I needed this. <laughs> <laughs> who won? Who won? A guy named Andrew who's awesome, but you know, I. Fuck I, I, you, Andrew. No, Andrew's great. <laughs> we love Andrew. Hi, Andrew. Um, we were just quoting Johnny Cakes just then when we. You said don't want to. You, you don't want to. Yeah, you don't have to win. You know what I mean? You don't have to win the reality show. Right. And you, you kind of won reality, though. You just have to steal their hearts. I don't know if I stole. You did. I the mean, winner did. isn't like the real winner. What you're really, you know, you gotta keep your mind on the prize. You win the game you play. Gosh, <laughs> I need some fucking ad viche, and my best ad viche ceviche, uh, brose is Miles A. Bonsignore. It's advice that'll go for miles. Tune into your radio station. It's advice that'll go for miles. Everyone get ready, Miles Nation. Miles Nation, go. If I say I'll go four miles. If I say I'll go four miles. What's up, hoes? Hey. <laughs> I got hoes. In different area codes. We're going back to the office. Yep. Howdy, everybody. I hope you're having... Howdy. Have you ever wanted <laughs> to... <laughs> Keith's phone fell. <laughs> Have you ever wanted to make your life actually better than you could ever think? <laughs> Always optimize from my old. Have you ever wanted your morning routine to be so good that you couldn't possibly know any better about it being so good? A job well done is half a gun. Mandy Moore. Ooh. More like Mandy less. <laughs> <laughs> Because you're going to be screaming for more when I tell you that the best way to freaking have a little snack is to defrost your fish in a warm bowl of water. <laughs> I had two little fish from Costco from who knows when the fuck in my freezer last night. Did they taste like sponges? Yeah. <laughs> but I defrosted them in 30 minutes or less. But you got to keep changing out the water, you know what I mean? Well, I kind of I read that it had to be running water, and I kind of did partial on that. But oh. then it turns out that I did the internal temp of the fish, and the inside was maybe still frozen when I cooked it, so I burned the outside of the You fish. run the water for 30 minutes straight? Yeah, but that's a waste wow. of water, though, is the problem. So I didn't want to do that. So I And they said do cold water, so I actually did warm. Take it in the shower with you. Oh, there Take we go. Take it in the shower. Take your fish in the shower. That's actually not a bad idea, Johnny. Hold <laughs> your fish <laughs> in the shower to defrost. Use it as soap. And you can soap oh. your body up oh. while you're getting fish stuff. Fish oil. Fish, fish oil. Omega-3s. Omega-3s are good for you. Fatty acids. Yeah. Yes. More like fatty asses. Woo! <laughs> in the shower. In the shower. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, basically I defrosted fish. And I think frozen fish is a really nice thing to eat. Mm, yes. So here's the thing: almost all the fish you're eating has been frozen at some point. There's a really cool guy, Keith, that I want you to see. <laughs> Is he the guy who does the sushi? Yeah, can we do that at the office? Is I think a big we should thing? try. Because it's like seems like forbidden, but it's kind of he's like not died yet. Do we do it as a thing where we do it and see if we get shit food our brains poisoning? out? Yes, exactly. Like, will we get food poisoning from TikTok? It should be the name of the video. But I don't think you would because he says it's frozen. But I don't know. I'm trusting a TikTok, and I'm yeah, but be wrong. There's other reasons you can get food poisoning. Yeah, but he seems smart and he hasn't died yet. And he keeps doing it. So if he was shooting his uh, brains out, he wouldn't be doing it as often. You know what I mean, Johnny? Yes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, I just wanted to say that I I also like going to Costco. <laughs> and Oh yeah. And I'm really glad that you didn't you, you didn't throw out the fish cuz a lot of people just throw that out and food waste. We can't have any of it. And that's the type of advice right. that wins competition reality shows. Johnny, <laughs> congratulations on winning as a king. <laughs> We're so proud of you. Thank, <laughs> we, you. Thank you. We love you, Johnny, and we appreciate you coming on the show. Check out Johnny's YouTube channel. <laughs> you. And also yes, all the please, Johnny Cakes, you. Johnny Bakes, mm -hmm. Johnny which Bakes. was a pretty good one. <laughs> thank you. Um, on the Try Guys channel. Yeah. 
Yes, please make sure you uh, watch our other content featuring Johnny and watch Johnny's content featuring Johnny. Obviously, his TikTok has tons of amazing stuff. I assume it's Johnny Cakes. It is, and you should also check out Keith's stuff that <laughs> doesn't you. feature me. Thank you. Yeah, and Miles' stuff, too, and Rainey's stuff. Thanks, Thank Johnny. Thank you. Yes. Thank yeah, you for having me. Pinterest account. You're going to definitely want to watch Cheesemongering. Yeah, watch the cheese video <laughs> on Try Guys. It's blowing up. It's fucking top of the trending. <laughs> And uh, Keith, hit him with the try by seam thong. Well, it's one, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, seven. Wake up and take yourself to 7-Eleven and get yourselves three different kinds of cheesecake. Is a tripod. Woo!